Tommy? Oh, my goodness! Oh, oh, so good to see you. Are you here for a while? For now. Well, this is your house. It always has been. It is so great to have you here. Such a blessing and a surprise as well. Thanks, Mo. Can you? Oh my god. Welcome home! I missed you! I, I missed you. Are you back for good? Oh, let's let Tommy have a chance to relax. He just got here. Um, I was working on something upstairs. Let me go up there and wrap it up. And then I'm gonna make dinner for everybody. Oh, it's been so long since the three of us were together. Um, maybe we can have a little wine to celebrate. It sounds great. It sounds great. I was working on an assignment, so I'll come back down when I'm done, okay? Okay. Hey, stranger. Having some trouble? Hey, Sarah. I guess it has been a while since you've been back, huh? How long has it been? Three years. How'd you know I was back? Well, Kim texted me. Sounds about right. She thought I should know you were back in case, you know, I wanted to see you. I'm glad she did. It is good to see you. So that's all you have to say? You come back out of nowhere after three years, after everything we've been through, and all you have to say to me is, it's good to see you. I'm so sorry, Sarah. I never meant to hurt you. Everything we talked about, all those moments we shared, I think about them all the time. I'm sorry. Yeah, you're sorry. We were planning a future together. One day we're looking at rings, the next day you're gone. Where did you go? Look, Sarah. I know I owe you an explanation. And I promise you, one day I will give that to you. If you can ever remember and trust, have any faith in me, please know I will give that to you. 
but right now I just can't. I'm here, but that's all I can offer right now. I'm sorry. It truly is really great to see you. Show you out? I think I can manage. After all, I feel like I grew up in this house too. The people in this house are like my family. Welcome home. Maybe we can talk when you're ready. I just wanna know where you've been. You told Sarah I was home. I hope you're not mad. I knew she would want to see you. I'm not mad. Where were you? That doesn't matter. I'm here now. That's what matters. No. Mom and I go crazy wondering about where you are. I miss you. I don't know what you do, but I would like to know. Occasionally, I have to hurt people. I'm sorry, Kimmy. The things I've seen, the things I've done, those are things you will have only seen in your worst nightmares. But that's a weight for me to bear, not you. What's important is that I'm here now. And all that's over. And it is over. Right? Yeah. And I'm glad you're home. Come on. Mom made dinner and she has wine ready for us, so. Let's celebrate with her. That sounds great. <laughs> oh my God. Not too much. <laughs> I don't know if I can handle it. No. This is, uh, this is great. I mean, I know I've been away and I haven't shared a whole lot, but you should know when I'm gone, I think about you both all the time. And I know technically you're my foster mom and you're my foster sister, but you're my mom, you're my sister and that's forever. We love you. And you know, you're always gonna have a place to stay. It really is nice to see you home. Look, I still wear the necklace that you got me. I wear this every single day. <laughs> you're better together. Okay? As far as I'm concerned, you belong here. You can stay here just as long as you want, Tommy. As long as you want. Thanks, Mom. That's Trudy. 
Dang it. I I told my friends I was going to be out tonight. Um, are you going to be here in the morning? Absolutely. You have fun. All right. I love you guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Okay, be careful. All right. Kimmy? Hey, hey, Kim, Kim, hey, what happened? What happened? Look at me. Who did this to you? Kimmy, hey, look at me. Who did this to you? Dante and his friends. Who the fuck is Dante? Thugs that live in a rundown house at the end of the street. They party, fire guns, put their garbage everywhere. They're a bunch of fucking degenerates. Oh, she's not the first person they've hurt in our neighborhood. We should call the police. No. It's just gonna make things worse. Please don't do anything. I can't lose you again. Oh. Let's go upstairs. They took my necklace. Be careful. Slow. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, let's get you cleaned up. Everything's gonna be okay. She's asleep, finally. Is she okay? I think she'll be okay. Those guys are just pure evil. And nobody does anything about it. Because everyone's afraid of what they might do in return. I'm sorry about the necklace. These guys, they live in the neighborhood? Yeah. Unfortunately, I'm sorry they do. Everything will be okay. Kimmy will be fine. You know, this neighborhood would be so much safer without them. Believe me, if I could get rid of those fuckers, I would. These fucking bitches think they're entitled and shit, man. Why'd you slap me? She had it coming. We had a job to do. Yeah. Damn right she had it coming. Mm -hmm. Fucking hitting me and shit. <laughs> hey, what's happening tonight? Nothing. It's a typical Friday night. Probably hit the strip club later. You want to go? You know it. That's right. What the fuck is that? What? What the fuck is that? Hey, can we help you with something? Hey, yo, dickhead, are you deaf? What the fuck you looking at? Huh? Hey, yo, let's drop this dude, man. Go fuck him up, man. <laughs> Easy. Fucked with the wrong girl tonight. Fuck you, man. <laughs> Where is Dante? He's in the house, man. How many are in the fucking house? Three.
Mami. Told you I was done. Tommy! Tommy, please no. Tommy. Sarah? Hello, Tommy. If you ever want to see Sarah again, you're gonna fucking finish Mom. what you started. If you want her back, come and get her.